Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of The View. Today we are going to learn about how to upload an image in Firebase Cloud Storage View 3. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So here currently, um, here we have the images sections, right? So this is the storage part, right? <coughs> of your Firebase. Go to the storage and this is the storage part, right? So let's try to upload any of the image. Let's make a console over here. Okay. Any of the images I can make like um, this one, Hindi letter. Okay. Let's upload it. Upload. File uploaded successfully. Let's see. Let's reload this. Here you can see. First in the letter, it's uploaded, right? The same one. Okay, so we have successfully uploaded the file to the Firebase Cloud Storage. Let's dive into the code level, how we are going to achieve that one. Okay, so here we go with the code. So this is the app view, right? So this is template. So we have a button at the red click upload file. Okay, when there is a handle change. Okay, so let's click on the handle change event. So it return the handle file upload. Okay. And this is upload file. Right. So it's returning that one. So let's check the method. That's important. So here we go with the button on click upload file. So when we click on the button. Okay. What will happen? So this is upload file. Let's click on this. This is the function. Okay. So here we go with the upload file. Right. So this is selected dot file dot value. Let me word wrap this. Okay, so we have the two files we have in the setup. Okay, so first we will explain that this file, then we will go with the Firebase configurations. Okay, so first we have the button in the template section. Then when we click on the upload button, then we have to upload that into the Firebase Cloud Storage. So this is select the file reference handle file upload. So selected file dot file value by default it's null. Then we will we will add the file reference over to that file, right? The value. Then if selected dot file value, if it is, then storage. We will take the reference from the storage, right? Then re reference to the root of the storage bucket. So it's a reference of that one. Then file reference storage dot child selected file dot value dot name reference to the file name. Then await file ref put selected file dot value then we will log that one that file uploaded successfully okay and here then return the handle file upload and the upload file both functions okay so this is that the template file then we go with the firebase okay so this is the configuration file then we have the firebase storage don't forget to include that firebase storage then you have the firebase keys so you need to get it from the settings so this is process project settings so here we have the web app so just need you need to copy these settings api key and everything okay this is done after that you need to add this one app firebase initialize app with a firebase configuration then storage firebase dot storage then export that storage part okay and in the same app view, you can see that the storage we have import. Got it? So by doing this, you are successfully able to upload the images, upload video, anything you can upload on the Firebase Cloud Storage. Any doubt, any query, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.